Kate and William display patent desire to heal Rift after Prince Harry's histrionics. Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, and Prince William have responded to Prince Harry's remarks by showing a patent desire to heal the Rift, according to a commentator. Kate and Prince William have not replied in kind to the comments made by Prince Harry and Meghan during their public appearances and interviews over the past few months. According to writer and commentator Melanie Phillips. Rather, she said, they carried on with their work, showcasing duty to the crown, modesty and loyalty. In an op-ed published by The Times, Ms. Phillips wrote, when people are personally attacked, the public look carefully at how they react under such pressure. The Cambridges have not replied in kind to the histrionics from Prince Harry and his wife. Instead, they have responded with grace and the patent desire to heal the rift. The Duchess of Cambridge, Ms. Phillips added, appears to have been particularly driven in her efforts to heal the rift between the royal brothers. Ms. Phillips wrote, the principal mover in this appears to be the Duchess. Kate seems to be an instinctive peacemaker, anxious to bring the feuding brothers together for the sake of all important family unity. Her gestures at Prince Philip's funeral aimed at enabling a conversation between William and Harry gained wide attention and approval. It was here that the steel in her character, and its value to the royal family, became apparent. Ms. Phillips referred to the successful attempt by the Duchess of Cambridge to break the ice between her husband and her brother-in-law following the funeral of Prince Philip. On April 17, after the poignant funeral service at St. George Chapel in Windsor, Kate was spotted starting a conversation with Prince Harry while Prince William was speaking to the Dean of Windsor outside of the church. As the royals started to walk back to Windsor Castle to attend a reception hosted by the Queen, the Duchess of Cambridge drew in the conversation her husband. She was then seen smoothly leaving the brothers alone to speak as she joined Sophie, Countess of Wessex.